I'm Pastor Sammy and welcome to Treasure Tuesday. You have just been on my heart, especially as school is set to begin. And there's a scripture that came to mind about what we should put on every day. You might usually be thinking about what you would wear for your first day of school and maybe you'll do that in person like normal and wear a fancy outfit or um, maybe you'll be home and the pressure will be a little lower than it usually is to find just that right thing. Or maybe you don't care at all what you wear on the outside, but this is about what we wear on the inside. I'm gonna read just a couple parts of it for you. This is Colossians chapter three. As God's chosen ones, holy and beloved, clothe yourselves with compassion, kindness, humility, meekness, and patience. Bear with one another, and if anyone is a complaint against another, forgive each other. Just as the Lord has forgiven you, so you must forgive. And whatever you do, in word or deed, do everything in the name of our Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through him. While I was just thinking about how we would clothe ourselves, what we would bring with us, what we would put on every day. And I thought that we could demonstrate that together by what I have here in my bag of treasures. I have a cup here. And I want to fill it up with all the expectations and our hopes we might bring with us for this year. The things that we hope are going to happen but might not. The games, the um, recitals, the events, all the things that uh, usually we put our um, hope and expectations in in the school year. Fills up this cup about a third of the way. And I want you to think about the things that you might put on and what you would wear. I have these on rocks and I've written the words on help me remember. Here's perseverance, hope, respect, love, it's my biggest one, kindness, oh, and I have patience and joy but there's no room for them in my cup. It's already full. So I wonder what would happen if I did it a little differently. So I've got another cup, the exact same size, and I've got these same rocks. And I'm gonna fill them in a little differently this time. First, my biggest rock, love. Kindness. Respect. Hope perseverance, patience, and joy. There's even room for joy. Let's see what happens. I have the same amount of dirt in this one. What happens when we try to fit in these same expectations? Do you think they will all fit? Do you think there will still be things that, I have some <laughs> roots in my dirt, but do you think there are still things that we will be able to enjoy this year about the school year? Do you think that there are some things that maybe won't be exactly the same, but we'll still get to experience like we have in the past? There's room for almost all of it still, just a little bit left. And you know what? Um, if I shifted my rocks a little bit, I think that we could fit some more. Let's see how much we can fit now. There we go. And there's still gaps, there's still plenty of room in my glass. Isn't it amazing how things fit when we do them in the right order? And you know what? There's even more space in here. And I think this water is a bit like God's grace that just, that rains on us and fills us up quenches our thirst when we feel like we are dry and empty. It's even filling in more. I could add more. <laughs> and our cup overflows. 
Dear ones, this year is different. This year is going to be hard. There's not much getting, there's no getting around that. But God is with you. God's grace covers you and fills you up. I hope that you will take this image with you um, as you begin this school year. That you'll take God's love with you and that you will bring that love with you wherever you go. God's peace be with you. I hope that you'll join us tomorrow for Creative Wednesday with Pastor Betsy. And if you liked what you saw today, that you will subscribe to the channel on YouTube, like us on Faith Finders Fun on Facebook, and that you'll join me again next week.